It's one of Florida's wildest and most untouched corners. The Osceola National Forest in North Florida is expansive, nearly a quarter of a million acres brimming with things to do and places to scout. There's birding trails, hiking trails, biking, fishing, camping, ATV riding, you can go boating, we have horse trails. For those like me in search of solitude and adventure, you'll find it here amongst the pine flatwoods, wetlands, and hammocks. There are historic hikes like the Trampled Trail, a relic of the area's sawmill history, and trails built for bird and photography lovers. Trails that lead to the most solitary spots like the federally protected Big Gum Swamp Wilderness Area. Uh, Gum Swamp Wilderness is a very secluded area, so you hike in. We have a six mile well-marked hiking trail. Trails that traverse the whole nation pass through here, and some you don't even have to do on foot. We've been developing a wonderful ATV trail system. A lot of people don't know that they can bring their ATVs out here for free, and there's over 75 miles of connected trails, and we're in the process of developing a campground for ATVs. And for a more modern twist on the kind of exploring you can do around here, all you need is your phone for geocaching, a GPS-based scavenger hunt, and it tells me there are no less than 20 geocaches within a mile from my location. And since we're all visitors here, you will undoubtedly run into a local or two or three. The kinds of animals that you see are the deer, the fox squirrels, the Bachman sparrow, there's the East Indigo snake. And of course, one of the most sought after species is fish. Uh, Osceola has about 30 different fishing ponds throughout the forest. There's 244,000 acres here. And if you're not up for all that travel, one of the most attractive spots is Ocean Pond, a 2,000 acre lake, and the Osceola National Forest's prime recreation area. The local story is that it was created by an asteroid, but at the forest we think it was created through a sinkhole. Picturesque campgrounds dot the shores of the lake, some with water and electric, others speak to the seclusion of the area. For water enthusiasts, this is home base. Whether it's a day or a week, Ocean Pond attracts those looking to get away. So there's all this to explore, and aside from a small parking or camping fee, it's free! Enjoying wild Florida in the Osceola National Forest, I'm Janice Jones.